for now i'll be able to beat majma but more importantly i'm just i'm just gonna finish off the races 2005 pocket circuit cup king of speed okay it's it's just it's now or never to win this oh okay i'm i'm a little scared i don't i don't think we're gonna win my gauge is not there I don't have the gauge. One more lap. One more lap. As long as we don't have to stabilize. I was worried about this. How do we not die? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yes. Dragon of Pockets are getting reborn. Woo. Oh my god. Two second gap. We're the champions of Pocket Circuit again. We're the fastest of Kamurocho as soon as we beat Majima. Get your ass over here. We're gonna race him. We should beat Majima here. Oh, I was worried about this. Boost. There we go. 35 seconds for that. We only beat him by one second. I'm glad I boosted. Holy shit. We are the fastest in Camarocho. <laughs> the Dragon Dojima is the beast on the streets on the ace of the race. I half expected this, Cosmo-kun. Your machine was incredible, Goro-kun. Your ability to customize a machine to this level in such a short time is actually pretty scary. Not gonna lie. It don't matter. The title can only go to one man, and that's you. You're Camarocho's fastest. So you must have the confidence to back that shit up. And you're not looking for a rematch? Yeah. Nah, this is the end. If I keep this shit up, I'm gonna forget the joy of punching dudes in the face. I gotta retire my wheels. <laughs> and it's back to selling things the old way. I'm gonna give you this, and you better like it. Woo, we got the wild snake! But... Just because we're done with pocket circuit races don't mean I'm done with you by a long shot. I'm going to be on your ass wherever you are. So be ready for me, cosmo -kun. Oh, that feels good. The races may be done, but my connection to Majma-san is far from over. Our struggle continues. Anyway, we now need to go to the docks. Um, we also need to do a few other things, I think. Also, whatever's at the hotel. You know what? Let's go to the hotel district because we're right up here. Are these the gangbusters? What? I want to let that guy lead you bunch of morons if I knew he was just going to pick him off. Son of a bitch. Forget it. Just get out of my sight. Yeah, this is going to be gangbusters. I'm guessing that's the son of the guy who organized that vigilante group. The gum boogers. Even now, he can't remember it. Look. Hey, are you a sano? Huh? Uh, so what if I am? That vigilante group you've been manipulating from behind the scenes has been kind of a pain in the ass. Uh, what are you talking about? I don't know nothing about that. Uh? Don't play dumb. That leader over there gave up your name. Uh? Uh, so what if I did do all that? If you keep bugging me about it, I'll bust your ass like those morons bust gangs. Uh. Guess asking you nicely isn't going to cut it. Uh -huh. Oh, so you want a piece of me, huh? Bring it. You can regret your stupidity later when you wake up in the hospital. Oh, you think he got moves? You know what? He's, he's got some decent moves. There we go. I give up. Please forgive me. I'll forgive you, but only if you disband that group of punks immediately. Yes, understood. I'll make sure it happens right away. You're Yakuza yourself, aren't you? 
Then why were you riling up the hooligans in this town to begin with? Well, there are a shit ton of families springing up lately. I thought our family would do better for itself if some of the other rivals were called from the herd. How pathetic. So you pulled whatever underhanded tricks you could to avoid getting your own hands dirty. Hi. Yes, sir. It's true. And I'm very sorry about it. Here's some compensation for your trouble. Please take it. 30 grand. Uh, uh, oh my god, we're under. Oh, oh, oh god. So please, could you please keep this embarrassment between us? I didn't realize how much money we spent in pocket circuit racing. <laughs> Damn, to think the Tojo clan has such shameful men. And I guess we can see what's this sub story. Excuse me, mister. Do you have a moment to do me a favor? If you're looking for a John, I'm not buying. No, look, there's this weird creep who's been stalking. Oh, God! Could you please get rid of him? Is there a reason you need me of all people to do this? What? Isn't it your duty as a big, strong man to protect a defenseless woman in danger? I don't know about that. Sorry, I've got a lot going on right now. Do you want a reward or something? I'll pay you. I promise. I guess I'll talk to him. Fine, I'll talk to him. Keep your reward, though. <laughs> My hero. My name's Junko, by the way. Thank you. I'm only going to talk to him, but... Keep your distance, all the same. Okay, thank you. How do I always find myself in these situations? I guess it couldn't hurt to ask what he's doing, though. Buddy, what the fuck? It's probably the creepy guy Junko was talking about. Hey, you. What? What's your problem? You're acting kind of creepy, and it's upsetting that woman you're staring at. What woman? I have no idea what you're talking about. I'm just going about my business here. What is it? You got something to say, man? Cut the crap. Boy. Cut the crap. Stop creeping on her and be on your way. What the heck are you talking about? Is that a threat? Yeah. I'm not threatening you. I'm giving you a chance to stop harassing people in public. What are you even trying to see? Yeah. Harassing? I was only gazing longingly at the beautiful woman down the street who happened to catch my eye. It's a naturalistic for a man, isn't it? That look was anything but natural. Then who are you to come at me with this shit? So happens my buddies with a big shot Yakuza want me to call him? Go for it. Mm. Yeah, give him a call. If he even exists, I'll wait. Uh, I'll do it. I've got him on speed dial. Are you sure you want to die? Do it. Uh. Yeah, pretty sure I won't be the one dying. Do it. Your funeral, man. Okay. Hello? <laughs> now you're really fucked, man. I doubt it. And here he is. Apologies won't even save you now. Uh -huh. You the fool picking fights with my man here? Guess you need to get taught some respect. Just shut up and fight. You're fucking dead, you bastard. You don't even have a pin. Yakuza my ass. Oh, you want some of this too. Okay. <laughs> What is this? A firecracker. Well, would you look at this? In your mouth? That's murder, Kiryu. That's murder. We murdered a man. Again. Who the hell is that guy? Have we learned anything today? Yeah, forgive me. I'll be good. And you're dropping the stalker thing, right? Yes. I'm surprised he can talk after having his tongue blown out of his mouth. I saw everything. Oh my god, you were awesome. I think he's done following you around. <laughs> that way he put a firecracker in his mouth. Oh my god, teeth went everywhere. I'm so glad I found you. It isn't much, but here, take this. 30 grand. The city's getting more and more dangerous for a woman. Be careful on your way home, okay? I will. What the hell? <laughs> Guess I should be glad it wasn't a con job. Because <laughs> we're so used to that. Let's go spend some completion points. Trade in some CP. Altered Beast. 777. Ying Long Tonfa. Dragon Shirt. Let's see. Takuma Kun is working at Stardust. But. Thank you very much. Come back again soon. <laughs> Bye!
please tell my dear Kazuki Sam uh, I said hi. Okay. Damn it. Looks like he's from Stardust. I'll try asking him. Hey, can I talk to you for a sec? Huh? Hmm? What's up? I heard a guy from Takuma works here. I heard a guy named Takuma works here. Is he around? Takuma, you say? Who wants to know? Hmm? Wait. That formidable face. That voice like brass knuckles. Kazuma Kun. Uh. Huh? Uh. Yeah. Could you be. Yeah, it's me, Takuma! Nani. What? Takuma Kun? <laughs> you look so different now! I couldn't tell! And you haven't changed at all, bastard. <laughs> you think so? Wow, it's been so long. I wanted to talk to you. Are you free? Sorry, but I've got nothing to say to you. Well, shit. Wait, the pocket circuit fighter needs your help. Eh? It's a matter of life. A life worth living. The man can't go on in his current state. Oh, so he's re finally getting his life together, and he needs help finding a successor? It's a pretty big deal. The fighter may not get another chance like this. I don't doubt that, but what's that have to do with me? Takuma-kun, what would you think about becoming the next generation pocket circuit fighter? Eh? Huh? <laughs> me, a pocket circuit fighter? Uh. Yeah. The fighter said that he doesn't want someone who isn't qualified to succeed him. He wants someone who loves pocket circuit from the bottom of his heart. That's why. If that's the case, I can't become the next fighter. I don't ever even want to look at this set of tires anymore. What? I'm way too old to be playing with toys, man. And the fighter's life has nothing to do with mine. If that was all you wanted to ask, I'm out of here. Takuma. You don't race anymore? You don't play pocket circuit anymore? Of course not. I'm turning 27. I said it before, and I'll say it again. I'm too old to be playing with toys. Okay, fine. I'll, I'll give you that pocket circuit cars or toys. But playing with them gave you friends and experiences you'll never forget. The reason we're talking now is thanks to pocket circuit. And you can't say this toy doesn't have meaning. I know that. But I've already decided that I'm never playing pocket circuit again. I had some rough times. How rough? Are you talking about how you wanted to become a pro racer? Oh... So you know about that? Uh. Yeah, Hideki-kun told me. And you should already know, I don't even want to hear the word race, so leave me alone. I'm a host now. Hey, Takuma, when did you become such a sissy? Huh? What? The Takuma-kun I knew used to re-customize even when he lost a race. He never gave up on winning. He always worked that much harder to make a comeback. But now, the man before me is running away from reality. He's throwing himself into a world he doesn't care about just so he doesn't have to face the truth. Pathetic. It's fine to work hard at a host club, but you're not even that great at it. And that's because you don't care about this one bit, isn't it? Uh, I can't force you to become the next pocket circuit fighter, but I better see you at the stadium. The stadium? For old time's sake, I'll beat the cowardice out of you in a way only you'd understand on a racetrack. Like I said, I don't want to. I'll be waiting with everyone else. Nuve Rich! Nuve... Oh my god. Oh, you got a gun? You don't got a gun. Oh. Kazuma-kun! Did you go talk to Takuma-kun? Yeah, I spoke to him. But the rest is up to him. He's not going to accept without conquering his demons. I see. I see. But Takuma-kun must have his reasons. I don't want to have forces upon him. But I do hope we can help pull him out of his slump. I'm worried about the guy. Yeah, just give him some time. He has a lot to think about. I told him to meet me here, but we'll see. If you told him to come, I'm sure he'll come. Ah. Yeah, 
He's right. We'll wait as long as it takes. Well, yeah. since we have some time, why don't we race? If we just enjoy ourselves racing, maybe Takuma Kun will sense the fun and come by. Uh, it's not like Takuma Kun has a fun sensor, but I do kind of want to see the fighter back in action. <laughs> <laughs> That's great, because I've been itching to burn some rubber myself. Fine, it's been a long time since I've raced you for real. And talk to me when you're ready. I'll be looking forward to your new and improved car customizations. Sir, you have no chance. You have no chance. I have the perfect guide. Um, Battle of Fighter. I changed my settings and I'm ready. Let's fight, fighter. I'm not gonna go easy on you, Kazbakun. Alright, so for this fight, we need Ultra Spiked, which we have on. We need Ultra Metal, which we have on. We need Ultra Godspeed Motor, which we have on. The gears need Ultra Boost. We have that on. The battery needs to be high capacity, which we have. Side stabilizers need to be on. The suspension needs to be heavy, and we need a bumper plate. The decal? It's got to be Wild Snake. Let's race. Two, one, go! We're neck and neck. We're neck and neck. We're no longer neck and neck. <laughs> Come on, fighter. This is kind of a letdown for the ultimate race. Like, the Modmo race was a lot faster! <laughs> talk shit! I talk shit! What's wrong, Cosmicoon? Your car wasn't as slick as usual. Sorry, I guess I messed up my customization. Here we go. I didn't hit you! Heinous, you defeated my specially customized machine. Still, I didn't. I wouldn't expect anything less from you, Cosmicoon. The title of the Kamarosho's fastest fighter is yours once more. Wow, Cosmicoon, you're too cool for school. That was a good race, fighter. You're as formidable as ever. Uh. <laughs> Both of you did great, then, for the next race. You'll face me, Cosmicoon. <laughs> you're here. Uh, Takuma! Fighters, they understand. Cosmicoon. You know what? I, uh... You don't have to put in words. If you're a real racer, you can express yourself on the circuit. You're right. I challenge you, Cosmicoon. Put your fist down, son. Two, one, go! Jesus, man! Shit, that's, that's really quick. That's really quick. Okay, now we're pulling ahead. Fantastic. And I think that's all the racing. You're really fast, Cosmicoon. For sure. But Takuma Kun's machine was really fast, too. Takuma, you still had your old machine? It looks as slick as the day you bought it. Yeah, I just couldn't forget about racing. And I couldn't let go of Pocket Sir either. I see. But I was so frustrated about failing to become a racer. And because of that shame, I couldn't fall show my face here. Every time I saw a machine, I was reminded of my failure. Takuma. That's why I tried out so many different jobs. I only wanted to find something else I could be passionate about. But I just couldn't get away from racing and competition. I did like the competitive aspect of getting more customers to request me at the host club. But... There's a competition for that? The pocket circuit is where it all started. And I realized, as I was racing against Kazuma's Kun, that I love Pocket Circuit. I want to keep feeling the thrill of battle that only this stadium can provide. So, Takuma Kun, does that mean? Fighter, would you allow me to succeed you and become the second generation Pocket Circuit fighter? I want to fulfill my dream once again, right here. Uh. Yeah, of course. You're okay with that too, right, Cosmicoon? Uh, yeah. Takumakoon, you have that same fire in your eyes as the first time I met you. Thanks, Cosmicoon. If you didn't invite me to come back, I would probably... I would probably still be moping around. <laughs> Good. I'm looking forward to your commentary as the next-gen fighter. Leave it to me. Oh, and this is a thank you for today. It's a good part, so try it out sometime. Godspeed Motor Mark II. Isn't this the Godspeed Motor Mark II? Thanks, Takuma. 
I'll definitely put this to use. Hey, Takuma Kun, how'd you customize your machine like that? I haven't raced in a while, so I want to know. Yeah, sure. I can show you. Let's go to that table then. Wait, wait. Mikachun, I can teach you too. Boy. Hey, guys. What is it? You guys better get along. No getting into stupid arguments. Where are you bringing that up all of a sudden? <laughs> We've been friends since we were kids. We'll never fight. <laughs> That's true. Sorry. Guess I was being a worry wart. <laughs> You're so funny, Cosmicoon. You should come too. Let's customize our cars together. Sure. I'll join you later. I can't thank you enough, Cosmicoon. You saved me again. Yeah. No. This is nothing. I'm just relieved that this issue's been taken care of. When are you going to retire? <sighs> Let's see. First, I'll have to go to Takuma Kun's current employer to ask for approval to take him under my wing. And then there's other paperwork to fill out. So it's going to be at least a little while. So until then, we'll still get your live commentary? Uh. Yep. I'll be delivering passionate play by plays until the end. And after I retire, I'll take over my family business. You said your family business was tofu. Is it far from here? Uh. Yeah. In a town as country as country gets. I won't be able to come out to Kamurocho very easily. I see. Then we won't see you as often. But if we stayed healthy... We could meet again, for sure. True. Well, you finally found yourself a wife. I wish you both a long and happy life together. And who knows, maybe in like eight years when Facebook finally takes off, uh, we'll find each other on there. No, oh, thanks. And if I'm about to run off course, I'll keep my hands on the wheel and hold out, just like you would. <laughs> nice one. Peter, we've made new machines. So can you commentate? For sure. I'll be right there. Cosmicoon, let's race this time. I'm gonna win. Uh. Yeah, just a sec. Well, I'm gonna go. That's a positively enjoyable storyline. No matter how old I am, Pocket Circuit gets me fired up. What a thrill to be racing again. And congratulations, fighter. It's a great story. Yeah. <laughs> that, was, that was worth nothing. <laughs> that was worth nothing to us. Okay, let's let's get our asses back to purgatory. Chapter 12. Reunited. Find Kazuma. Uh, better save your questions for Tarada Sen. Just be careful, there's no telling whether the others will find this place. Everything's going according to plan. What plan is that? Look, I know you're you'll need to see it for yourself, but keep this in mind. Tarada Sen is a man who honors his debts. He's a good man. Kazuma Kiryu, right? We're direct subordinates of Tarada Sen. Uh. Our actions aren't even known to Omi Alliance headquarters. The only ones in the loop are the people right here. Why is the Omi Alliance even involved? Where's Kazuma San? He's waiting for you on board. You can get more details from him directly. Cool. All right, let's go. Come on, Punchkin. あの人。多分。バッティングセンターで助けてくれた人。ペンダントのことを教えてくれた。行くぞ、ハルカ。
よく来たなカズマおやさんご無事だすまなかった苦労をかけたなあの寺田って男はもともと俺と同じ元ヒットマンだそうだったんですか大見連合本部長の肩書きで登場会に探りを入れてもらってた特に錦山をな,なあカズマこれからこの10年間に隠された全てを話すいいなはいその子の母親の水木は由美の妹じゃないえ由美は由美は水木なんだお前たちが水木だと思って探してた女は由美だったんだどういうことです水木は5年前から由美が演じ続けた姿なんだじゃあはるかの母親っていうのは由美だその子は正真正銘由美の子なんだ由美お姉ちゃんが私のお母さんおやさん由美の相手いやはるかの父親は神宮恭平だ神宮あの MIA のユミガタキカカエテルノワハルカヨコニューツティルノガジングダユミガジケンのショックでキヨコシナタコトワシテルナはいジケンのヨクジツユミアナニモワカラナイママビョインオトビダシタダガアノコノカラダオボエティタンダヨジブンガマレソダタヒマリノバシオナヒマリ俺は連絡を受けすぐに弓を手元に引き取ったんだそしてあの子の記憶を戻してやろうとした何枚もの写真を見せた So Nishiki has a niece? And you kept it from him? Amen Hmm? どうしたわからないわからないけどおはそのときわかったんだ。どうじまくみちをこしたのが本当は誰だったのかをな。そして錦山には弓の存在を知らせず、彼女の世話をすることにしたんだ。でも、ユミはなんで神宮なんかと神宮はセラと深いつながりがあって、よく登場会に出入りしていた。その時、偶然ユミに出会ったんだ。神宮と会長が正解を目指す神宮はセラから裏でバックアップを受けていたんだ。神宮はユミに出会い、恋をした。そして記憶を失っていたユミは心の隙間に入ってきた。神宮を受け入れた俺は止めることができなかったもし神宮と幸せな生活が送れるなら極道社会とは縁が切れるかもしれない運命を変えられる転機なのかもしれないそう考えると弓の幸せは神宮との生活の中にあるような気がしたんだそして弓は神宮の幸運だそれがはるかだだが神宮のもとに総理の娘との縁談が舞い込みその時席を入れてなかった弓は自ら身を引いた神宮のためを思ってなだがそれが歯車を大きく狂わせていったんだ所詮神宮が手に入れた権力は他人から与えられたものだだが奴はそれを守るために少しずつ変わっていった自分の中では正当化しながらその後ユミとハルカは俺がまた面倒を見ていたそしてある日セラに神宮から緊急の電話が入ったんだセラ定
貸してくれまずいことになったなんだいいから来てくれ人を何人かやる場所はいやお前一人で来てほしいんだ何なんだ死体を一つ始末してほしい神宮は弾みで起こった事故だと言い張ったそうだ死体はフリーの記者で神宮のスキャンダルユミとハルカの件でゆすろうとしてきたらしいセラは記者の家からメモや写真を奪い全て廃棄しただが神宮にとってまだこの事件は終わってなかったんだこれでもう問題ないんだないやもう一つ片付けなきゃならないものがあるねえもう二度とこんなことがないようにするためにあと二人始末してほしいんだお前もしかしてセラこれは俺たちの理想のためなんだ頼むチングサンダイメカザマさん、これは神宮との約束なんです。女子供を犠牲にしてまで守らなきゃいけない約束ですかそんなもんがあるわけねえだろう不幸か不幸か。ユミはその時すべての記憶を取り戻したんだよ。ユミとハルカを。ジング。なんてやろうだ。俺はセラを説得し。ユミとハルカを。神宮の目から欺く工作をした。そのための。水木やアレス。ああ。俺とセラはハルカをひまわりにで。弓を水木へと変身させた。任弁し、偽造屋を雇い弓の顔を変え、架空の戸籍や記録を作り上げてな。でも、おやつさん、なんで弓は登場界の100億を盗んだんですかあれは登場界の金じゃない。神宮の100億だったんだ。風間さん、島のゴミの連中が、ここはやばいです。Zero. Are we going to be battling on a boat again? I think we're going to be battling on a boat again. Cosmo, you bastard. Shimanome. Mucha shangaru. <laughs> 